What's up YouTube? Um, this video is how to fix your um, Call of Duty. First off, you're going to go to your NVIDIA control panel. After you reach NVIDIA control panel, um, you're going to go to your uh, global settings or you're going to click on your Call of Duty second settings. If your Call of Duty is not showing in the um, window, then you will have to add it. I'm pretty sure it should be there. But anyways, uh, you can change this in global settings again or um program settings um after you make your decision you're going to go down to multi display mixed gpu and you're going to um change that to single display um performance mode after that you're going to scroll down right up under it is um power management mode set that to preferred maximum performance um on all the other things you can um read the description at the bottom of the screen to see what they do um you can make your you know you can make your choice on what you want on or what you want off but as you can see some of the things that i have on and off right here you can follow my template it'd be perfectly fine i'm going to show you gameplay afterwards and let you see exactly um how my setup runs um, there might be a couple of things that i don't have on that you would like to turn on um the reason for this for me saying this is because I, right now i'm currently running a um gtx uh, 770 and in a little while I'm going to show you um, what I have it clocked to for um, Call of Duty okay right now I'm just showing you some of the things that I have on okay next thing uh, go to M MSI Afterburner when you get to MSI Afterburner oh wait no I'm sorry <laughs> Task Manager I'm going ahead of myself um, Task Manager that's the second thing up make sure all things are disabled in your Task Manager um, after you disable everything except for your NVIDIA um, drivers and Steam, uh, then you're going to go to your system. Click on Open System right here in the blue. You're going to click on that. And then you're going to go through and make sure that yours max matches mines. Um, don't disable anything because you could possibly mess up your system, especially if you're messing with Windows. It shouldn't mess up nothing if you're disabling other things other than Windows, but I wouldn't advise you to mess with none of that stuff. But um, make sure yours are looking just like mine's. Um, NVIDIA should be running. Make sure your NVIDIA drivers are running, and I set the manual. Um, then you're going to scroll down. You're going to find your uh, Windows update. I'm going to show you that in a second. Um, make sure your Windows update is um, running and set the automatic. And you're going to scroll down and then you're going to find workstation. Make sure your workstation is running and on automatic. Um, a couple of things was turned off, like my Windows updates was turned off. My um, workstation was running, but a couple of my NVIDIA drivers was off. So that could have been a problem. I'm not for sure, but I went. Uh, I did a thorough uh, troubleshoot. Next is um, MSI Afterburner. Make sure you had the latest um, Afterburner uh, set up. And I also downloaded a, um, the driver um, 337.5 um, for my NVIDIA. But um, once you get to after, Afterburner, you're going to go to your settings. You're going to um, turn on your um, unlock your core voltage. You're going to um, fiddle with your core voltage. Um, take it back and take it up whichever one but just make sure you put it back to zero make sure that you have two profiles one set for um, Call of Duty and one set for whatever your other settings are I mean for what other um, purposes you have you know um, I slightly underclock mines um, I guess that's a requirement for Call of Duty or whatever I don't know don't ask me I'm just saying this is what I did and it worked for me maybe it'll work for you Okay, next, I'm just showing you what most people um say. Go to Steam, go to your options in Steam, and they say turn off. Um, I can't think of the name of it right now. Um, but this, they say turn this off, but I turn mine on. And as you can see, 
Um, I'm having no problems. I'm starting the game right now. Normally, the game would stop working right around here. It'll blink, then the screen will blink again, and then it wouldn't be working. But as you can see, it's working for me. I have all my um, stats up in the corner, my um, frames per second, my um, memory I'm using, and also my GPU temps. I put that up there so you guys can see um, the uh, frames per second and temps that I'm getting while in gameplay. Um, I'm going to show you the settings that I have Call of Duty set to and why I don't have them all maxed out. Um, I can max them out, but my frames will be kind of low. I say, well, not low in the sense of 20s or nothing like that. You're going to see, but um, I say the lowest I got with everything was maxed out. I believe it was around, uh, uh, who I don't want to lie to you guys. <laughs> Y'all going to see in a second, but, um. I believe the lowest it went was 60, between 60 and 70, but I just don't like that. I like my frames to be at least about 90, so, you know, that's why I kind of go with high. Uh, I keep most of mine on high, but right now, I'm cranking everything up to um, max, extra, uh, however you want to uh, say it. But I put most things on extra. I left some things off because it would be ridiculously slow frames, so... You know bear with me on that but um the most common things that a person would turn on extra or you know max it, that's what I'm messing with now um I left dynamic fur off what's the purpose and water resolution you know there's no true cause for that but here we go I'm gonna let y'all enjoy um, this video and a little bit of music all right
as you can see my frames per second shot up there is at a good um 90 between 90 and 80 um this is where i like it so this is a sweet spot for me so um i'm gonna go ahead and show you the next uh gameplay all righty keep watching them frames per second 